Hello beautiful people and welcome to another video. As you guys already can tell from the title of this video, I'm going to be surprising my father with his favorite Colombian drink. Now I know personally that this is my favorite drink. I had it for the first time when I was nine. So the first and only time that I went to Colombia. So kind of a bummer. I've been able to get my hands on it um, a couple of more times. But it's been years since I've had it and I'm pretty sure it's been a lot more for my dad. So... I'm very excited to surprise him with this. We're not. I'm not going to show him the bottle because then he'll immediately know that it's that it's the drink. You know that it's his favorite drink. I'm going to pour the drink in a glass and maybe have him smell it. Maybe do a little bit of taste test. See if he can guess and figure it out, and then we'll have the uh, the big reveal. So. I'm very excited. I'm also very excited to try it because I'm going to be drinking some too with him. So, excited about that. Very excited about that. Without further ado, let's go call him and uh, see what his reaction will be. So, this is the drink. It's called Postobon. It's uva, which is Spanish for grape. So, this is a grape flavored it's like a carbonated drink okay it's just amazing i think they have like grape apple listen i haven't had this in such a long time i don't really remember all the flavors but there's a lot okay so this is just amazing 12 seconds later hola vamos a, a la sala en una pequeña sorpresa para ti yeah. ¿Cómo te llamas? yo me llamo luis mario ¿Y de dónde eres? Yo nací en Colombia, en el Valle del Cauca. ¿Cuál es una comida típica de Colombia? Acá? Típica de Colombia, bueno, conocidísima, es el sancocho. Varias carnes, hay mucha ganadería, lechería. Ah, Hace bueno. tiempo no visito a Colombia, pero... ¿Y de, y de tomar ¿qué, qué tienen allá? Hay muchos, hay muchas bebidas, como... De niño te dan agua de panela con leche. Ya. Sí, eso es la, el extracto de la caña de azúcar. Sin refinar, es comercial en, en Colombia, es muy sabrosa para nosotros con limón en el verano. ¿Y bebidas así que sean famosas, reconocidas allá en Colombia? Bebidas, en, ah, pues no faltaría nada. Postobón, es una gaseosa, sí. Muy, muy buenos vinos. Salud. Y ahorita vino. ¿Qué tenemos? Bueno, a ver, huele lo. ¿De qué es? Uva. Uva. Sí, ya yeah. pasó. Salud. ¿Ya pasó? No sé. No sé, pero es una bebida. ¿Ya pasó? Sí, creo que sí. A ver. Es algo... Sí. ¿Pasó? Creo que sí. Pasó. Pasó. Sí. <risa> salud. Salud. Y te vas a ver la cámara. Salud, salud. Salud, salud. Qué bueno. ¿eh? Hace muchos años, ¿ah? ¿eh? ¿Cuántos años? <risa> Hace como de... de... Hace unos... ¿Qué? De... de los Estados Unidos en 2007, ¿no? 2007. Sí, sí. 2007 ahora. ¿Cómo? 15 años. 15 años casi. <ríe> 15 años. Mm. Es eh, bueno. Luego de niño te gustaba mucho, ¿no? Pues, ¿no? Sí, a mí, para mí la, mi bebida favorita es el costón. Sí, es bueno. Mm -hmm. sí. Gracias por, por esa sorpresa. <ríe> bueno, el Perú la encacola, ¿no? Sí. Son bebidas bien marcadas en diferentes sitios de Sudamérica. A mí me gusta mucho, gracias. A mí me encanta el postón. Un amigo fue a Colombia y le dije, si vas a traer un postón, ¿me trajo vos? Sí, el postón me trajo. Gracias Dios. Gracias hijo. ¿eh? Buena sorpresa. Excelente. Entonces, that was a little surprise. Very nice. Rigo. Excelente. Gracias. Un abrazo. Well. Uh. Excuse me. There you have it. He was surprised. Honestly, the smell of Postobon is like unique. And every single one of their like flavors, like you can like it, distinguish it from other drinks. It's like 
super good. It, it, it doesn't really taste like artificial chemicals and colorants. Like it actually tastes like the fruit and it's like a carbonated drink. It's like a soda or a pop, if you will. So it's super good. Uh, I could tell he was excited. 15 years, this is five, but I, you know, 15 years, that is a very, very long time. So I'm glad I was able to do this for him. If you guys can ever do something for a loved one, for a friend, you know, something thoughtful, even like this small little gesture of, you know, hey, I have this postal one. Like the reason why I got it was really to give it to my dad. Or the reason why I asked for my friend to bring it was to give it to my dad. 15 years. I knew it had been many years, but I did not think that it was going to be 15 years since he's had a postal one. He was happy. He enjoyed it. I enjoyed being able to share it with him. If you guys can ever do a small little gesture, you know, it, it can go a long way for someone. Something like this, you know, it doesn't have to be necessarily having a carbonated drink with your father, but it can be something that means something to that other person. So I want to encourage you guys to, to do that today. Think of someone, think of something that you can do with that person, something that means something to them, even maybe just message them, tell them how much they mean to you, you know, if it's your mom, your dad, a brother, a friend. Just let them know you're thinking about them, encourage them in any way that you can. Share love and positivity with those around you. Just do it because that is what we're called to do. We're called to love others unconditionally. I hope you guys enjoyed this small little short video. Actually, I don't know how long this is going to be, but yeah. Bueno. Wow. <laughs>